Good afternoon, traders. This is Kevin Craney with RGL Futures with your afternoon financial market update. Markets trading back and forth and ending a little bit higher on the equity indices and uh, a bit lower on the interest rate futures here on the day. We continue to get a mixed read on the economy and really not a lot of macro data out, but really what we're watching is earnings data coming out today, really particularly from the likes of Caterpillar, uh, one of the biggest industrial companies out there. Uh, Caterpillar's Q3 earnings were good, but uh, really it's the guidance that we're looking at more in these earnings, and there's some mixed picture coming from the C-suite from a lot of these companies, and it's really the same thing that we're seeing uh, from the macroeconomic data that, we, that comes out, and that is that the economy is really lying flat on its back and cannot gain any momentum to move itself forward. We'll be watching the FOMC meeting as well as GDP data that's going to be coming out here later in the week, and I think that's really one thing, two things that the markets are going to be keying in on for just more direction on where this economy is. But we do have a presidential debate tonight We'll be listening for any signals from either candidate about specifics on their policies and how it may affect things moving forward for whomever candidate wins the presidential election in the coming weeks. Markets will be focusing on this, but really I would look for the back and forth trade to continue. If you look at the equity indices, if you look at the interest rate futures, really trading in a well-defined uh, back and forth trade right now. Looking at commodities, many of the commodities, they're also trading in a back and forth uh, position right now. And really, I think there's a lot of money that's sitting on the sideline right now waiting for the outcome of this presidential election in the coming weeks and waiting to hear what some of these candidates have to say uh, to better define themselves on where they may drive things should uh, or for whomever wins the presidential election. So I think that certainly one way to play this is just to continue to look at these channels and continue to look at the back and forth trade that, that, that develops as we go into the election season here uh, and, and try and, and, and make a play off of that. Please give me a call at 888-596-5817. As always, remember, futures trading is not suitable for everyone and does carry a high degree of risk.